Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you this beautiful circulated 1986 Roosevelt dime from our dimes collection. Together, we will look into highest amount for 1986 dimes at higher mint condition and find out for which amount they sell these days. But first things first, this dime is very briefly circulated. Strike is bold. President Roosevelt's left profile exhibits only tiniest ticks and seen scratches, which are visible only under close inspection. Major distraction is his little vertical gouge near the chin. Very light rub is evident on hair area. Fields are free from mentionable contact marks. Around the bust, we see many clad streaks extending like rays of a sun. Small amount of tarnish is visible by the lower ribs. On the edge, several reeds are worn as you can see. Backside of a coin demonstrates boldly struck design elements. Tiny planchet streaks grace the field throughout. Let's look into the torch for determining whether it's full bands. Upper bands do separate, but lower bands unfortunately display slight softness, which doesn't count for a full band. We have no distracting contact marks here as well. One thing to mention is this slight doubling on western color. These coins are current at circulation and worth just a dime at lower grades. US Mint struck more than 682 million dimes in Philadelphia. They are easy to find at higher circulated and lower uncirculated grades up to MS66. They become scarce adding full bands designation. They were rare at mid 67 with full bands and worth over $1,500. Here is 1986 P dime at MS67 FB condition. Problem free gem with razor sharp strike and full bands on the torch, which ended up selling for $1,997.50 in 2015 at Heritage Auctions.